Hola, Anyong, Konnichiwa, Bonjour, Ni Hao, Hello, Hi, I am Marjanis Armilla, a third year student in the University of Southeastern Philippines. So I am here to share my story with you. This is just a brief summary of my experience, or the moments that I can forget. So let's start with when I was in grade school. This is all I can remember though. There was a time that I wanted to be a part of the marching band's drummers, but sadly my mother refused because she believes that I can't handle it because I am a girl and I was skinny back then, which made me look weak at that time. And also, I'm not that girly too to join the majorette or the dancers, and I hate wearing short skirts that time, so I ended up um, being part of the lyrist. Lyrist, you know, are you familiar with that? Playing lyre. Even though I enjoyed um, playing lyre, there's still a part of me that longs to play the drums, though I could try it now, but I just don't have the opportunity and the time to do so. So furthermore, let's proceed to when I was in high school. This is just a part of it that I remember. So I have tried, I think we all have tried being the top of the town, the topic. So I have indeed been backstabbed by friends, friends, simply because I am close with my male friends. I enjoyed hanging out with them. They used to talk behind my back about how I am a whore, saying I am a whore or like that. I understand though that they are just immature and you know, Part, that's part of teenager, I think. And they'd make fun of me using my other classmate as a subject, telling her she was in Judy again and things like that, which I relished and joined in on. Only later did I realize that they were making fun of me, that that was meant for me. Funny, right? I made a fool of myself back then. Though I can't do a thing about it now, I just need to learn a lesson. That's all. So I tried changing schools in the hopes of finding a more calm environment, avoid in hopes to avoid backstabbers, gossips, and such. But yeah, again, I failed. And I'm still haunted by it. It's as though this bad energy is following me around and I can't do a thing about it. So I just need to embrace the reality of life, you know. So enough drama, let's get to the pleasant portion of my adventure. So it was when I was buying a baking ingredients in a baking supply in Diga City and they asked for my name and I told them my nickname, which is Janjan, and they'd always look at me like I was joking. They would double check it. But yes, again, I am not joking, Kuya. However, I understand it because we all know that John is a boy's name. It's just funny how in this generation, they still expect a girl to have or use solely a girl's name and vice versa. Though we won't be able to avoid situations like this, all I can aspire is for a better way of treating our fellow citizens, our friends, our families, and a more respectful society or community. And that's all. I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.